Come on guys, let's do this problem right here. So the question is asking, in a physics lab, you attach a 0.2 kilogram air track glider to the end of an ideal spring of negligible mass and start it and start it oscillating. The elapsed time for the time from when the glider first moves through the equilibrium point to the second time it moves through the point is 2.020 second. So we have two information right here. They are asking for the K, find spring called force constant. So let's see how we can find it. So let's put the given values m is equal to 0 0.2 kilogram. And this is actually the time, like if we have wave right here. So let's say this is a wave. And they are saying, so we have. Uh, the elapsed time from the when the glider first moves through the equilibrium point. So this is an equilibrium point right here. So it takes from here to here 2.0 second. 2.60 second right here. So if this is this is actually half half of the cycle. So we have the full cycle right here. So what do you have to do to find the period? We simply have to multiply this one by 2 so 2.60 by 2 actually 5.20 and that is the period so we have the period and we have the equation to find the constant that is omega square m we don't know the omega but we know the mass we can equate omega omega to 2 pi over t and this is going to be square times the mass. Now we have all the information. We can simply substitute all the values and find the final answer. So 2 pi divided by 5.20 square times the mass that is 0 0.2 kilogram. And that gives us 0 0.292 Newton per meter. And that is the final answer for this question. I hope you guys like this video. See you next time.